Hello, welcome to English for Everyone, where we practice real life American English. Today we're learning a great phrasal verb, so let's get started. Today we're learning this phrasal verb, waltz in. You can also use the preposition into, waltz into. They mean the same thing. Let's look at pronunciation. Waltz. The vowel is the sound aw. We see the sound in words like call and maul, audio and saw. The sound is in the back, back here, aw, waltz. Waltz. You see the letter Z, but we don't pronounce the zebra sound, z. We use the true S sound, waltz. So the T and the S together make the sound tss. Waltz. Waltz in or waltz into. It means to enter a place or a situation with confidence. But it's not a good thing. It's usually not used in a positive way. It's used in a negative way. When people say waltz in or waltz into, it's something that you're not supposed to do. It's usually something you shouldn't do. Let's hear some examples. Dirty. They're not exactly going to let John and I waltz into the castle. You think D.A. can just waltz into our bank, steal our money, and we're not going to kick? You can just waltz in here and take the food off my plate. This is. She'll just waltz in with some superstar lawyer who'll get us all canned for wasting the taxpayers' money. And our president is just willing to sit back and let them waltz in and take our country. Of all the gin joints and all the cities and all the world, you've got to waltz into my place and shoot my brother. Listen, pal, you can't waltz in here, use my toaster, and start spouting universal truths without qualification. I can't take him back to Washington and waltz into the White House with a list of empty demands. You think you're just going to waltz in here and steal my little girl? Did you just waltz in here and bark at your commanding officer? And in a, in a perfect world, you and I would just waltz into the court, you tell them what Shayla said, and they'd reopen your case. Example. Can you just waltz into a bank and ask for money? No, you cannot. You can't just waltz into a bank and ask for money. You have to fill out forms. You have to show your ID. You have to apply for a loan. You can't just waltz in and ask for money. They won't give it to you. Let's practice. Can you just waltz into a bank and ask for money? That's right. You can't just waltz into a bank and ask for money. They won't give it to you. Now, if I use here or there, I cannot use waltz into. I have to say waltz in. Waltz in here, waltz in there. I cannot say waltz into here or waltz into there. I have to use in in this case. So, you can't just waltz in there and ask for money. They won't give it to you. Let's practice. Can you just waltz in there and ask for money? That's right. You can't just waltz in there and ask for money. They won't give it to you. So remember the phrasal verb, waltz in or waltz into. Remember, the Z is not pronounced like a Z. It's pronounced like an S, waltz. Waltz in or waltz into. It means to enter a place or a situation with confidence, but usually in a bad way, when you're not supposed to. Thank you for watching. And if you like this video, subscribe to our channel. And if you want to become a member, click the join button. And we'll see you next time.